Hello all and welcome to our channel, At Home Product Reviews, where we provide our honest opinion about items that we've purchased and use around our own home, from tools to kitchenware and everything in between. Today we are reviewing this Brassica Green Tea with True Brock. We will post a link to this item in the description. Take the time to read the product description as well as the reviews from other purchasers. If you are interested in buying any of the products that we review, please use this link to support the channel. We receive a small commission for each purchase made. I first came across this product while watching a YouTube video made by Dr. Gundry talking about the health benefits associated with this tea. I will include a link to his video in, in the description. Regular green tea is full of antioxidants and a quick Google search on green tea reveals potential health benefits such as weight loss, cancer prevention, improved brain function, and improved heart health. But the Brassica green tea with True Brock takes it a step further. Brassica teas are the only teas on the market that, that have True Brock, which is patented and licensed by John Hopkins University School of Medicine. According to the True Brock website, glucoraphanin, the phytonutrient added to the Brassica tea, is a powerful and long-lasting oxidant antioxidant present in broccoli, but can be found in higher concentration in broccoli seeds and three-day-old sprouts. There are 15 milligrams of this phytonutrient found in brassica tea. The glucoraphanin contained in brassica tea with true rock is supposed to provide health benefits such as detoxification of the body, cap capture inactive free radicals, and inhibit the pathway of inflammation. The tea comes wrapped in single foil packets and this is what the tea bags look like. I do wish that the tea bags came with a strain, but at this time it does not. I made a cup of regular green tea as well as the brassica tea, steeped for two minutes as suggested by the company website. I'll taste test each of them now. While they claim that this tea doesn't have a broccoli taste, it doesn't have quite the same flavor as regular green tea. Comparing this tea to a cup of plain Bigelow green tea, this tea has a bit of an aftertaste. It isn't too strong, but I don't particularly care for it. Moya, however, says that she thinks it's fine and she enjoys it. I'll continue to drink this tea once or twice a week for the health benefits, but it won't be replacing my regular green tea anytime soon, especially when it costs so much more than regular tea. I recommend that you try it for yourself and see what you think. You may like it and the health benefits are quite potent. If there's anything that we miss or if you have any other questions about this item, let us know in the comment section and we'll do our best to respond. If you found this review helpful, please like and subscribe for future content.